<laughs> We're gonna go through stormy waters in this. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> I feel bad, but at the same time, if we don't kill them this fast, then I guess they would be suffocating and dying in cramped spaces or being frozen to death. I don't, I don't know. Why, I don't know why it's taking them so long to die, to be honest. Uh... Seven fifteen, trying to catch a bus to Kochang. Seven. Leaving in morning. less than half an hour. So we slept Breakfast for like of champions. Three hours. Or two, four hours, and now we're waiting for a bus to Kochang, but it says Lenka. Didn't catch this. We're headed to Kochang, and it's gonna be uh, raining every single hour. <laughs> It's not too late to turn back now. Well, really, because we haven't booked a hotel. It's a gambler's uh, issue right now because we're already ten dollars in the hole. We're gonna. <laughs> <laughs> we originally planned for uh, thirty bucks a night, but now we're looking up at forty seventy-five. That's the one we're gonna go for. It's a good thing we booked it last night because. All the seats are taken. This trip basically has no planning when going into it. There's supposed to be a storm. But if we come back alive, it's, it's a success. Pretty much as much planning as you did when we went to Cambodia. That was but, so horrible. That's why it ended up so horribly. When we actually planned, it was the worst. Remember, like we planned to have yeah, a better van. <laughs> broke down in the middle of the road. <laughs> Yeah. It's just gonna be a re relaxing vacation one anyways. <laughs> oh, this is nice. Hey, buddy. Nice and wet around here. Fucking taking selfies in the rain. <laughs> this fucking belongs in a scrapyard. Do you trust uh, this kind of service I've never even seen to him. take us I through stormy see. waters? I don't know. If he, I mean, the windows are missing and the. Uh... <laughs> Brings a uh, new meaning to crack the windows a bit. <laughs> Experiencing super low season. I've never seen it this empty, bro. Nice. If you've seen my uh, previous Kochang vlog, you'll know what a sunny, awesome, amazing ride this is. But this is quite foreboding. <sighs> Jonathan's digging it though. You're gonna fall through the floors, bro. <laughs> the only new world that exists as uh, Phuket, Krabi, Pattaya all touristed out. What do you think? Are you, are you feeling it? Are you happy you decided to come here? It's a good, a good spot for all the rain.
Yeah. <laughs> Alright guys, just checked in here to the Ewa Hotel and we were looking around for places to eat and coincidentally one of the all-you-can-eat seafood buffets that one of my students recommended I try happens to be right in front of the resort, the Kunkata Buffet. Jonathan, man. <laughs> oh, what the heck? A uh, cabbie. Okay. This is my favorite hockey mushroom. Oh, they're like running away. Oh my gosh. I don't know how we're supposed to, how we're supposed to do this. You just, you just grab it, I guess. Uh, live shrimp. Yeah. What? <laughs> wow! I think you gotta cool them down or chill it to so they die. Oh! Or to stun them. Oh, that's what you're doing. Oh. What the? What is happening there? Oh, yeah, yeah, I see it, I see it. Didn't you put like five in there and you end up with only two? They all jumped out, you amateur. We got orange, yellow, and gray. They even got pizza. How is it, bro? It's really good, but I don't know what it is. It's so seafood pizza. It. I think it's mayonnaise, tomato. I don't even know if there's any seafood. There's like pepper in here. <laughs> 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 is your hand okay? <laughs> Alright, guys. Not sure how many rounds this is, but this might be our last round. Do you know the Thai concept? Of it's for cleaning the spoons. Love <laughs> ice cream taco. All right, guys, just finished with this all-you-can-eat seafood buffet. It's still happening back there. Uh, we spent more than three hours there. Definitely got our money's worth. Three dollars an hour. <laughs> I, I can't believe I didn't know about this place. I mean, this is my third time here and I just found out about it. Like, skip the waterfall, skip everything else. That's an attraction on itself that shouldn't be skipped out on. You clearly know I'm not a food vlogger, like foodie foodie, but it's uh, something you gotta do. It's beyond the hype. Super awesome location right across our hotel. <laughs> they literally ride right across. They got a motorcycle rental place. 150 baht. Super cheap. About five bucks to rent a day. We're renting it around 9, 8.30. But he's gonna let us return it 
25 hours later. Oh, you see the biggest snails I've ever Fascinated seen. by the snails. They're huge snails. <laughs> this is sort of normal in Thailand, bro. Yeah, it's bigger than a quarter. It's been five years and not one of us has changed. Uh, what I'm thinking is, I know I can make it up there, but if I exert all my energy, how am I gonna come down? And, like, Jonathan was rushing me because of the ants, forgot the freaking coconut water that I brought all the way Just here. Just coconut water. Fucking coconut water, bro. Don't be a wuss. Dude, it's so beautiful though. Man, those are some short, short. Oh! Fuck. Thank you so much for checking out this video. And if you're interested in more content about what our life's been like since moving to Asia, we release two videos weekly. Longer neighborhood guides on Wednesdays and our regular travel and Bangkok vlogs on Saturdays. We hope you set that bell notification and see you guys next week for more vlogs about living and traveling in Asia.